My API service runs in two different environments, one for development and testing and another in production. How can I run playwright tests against both environments without having to rewrite my tests over and over again? Here's how to manage environment variables with Checkly to run the same check in multiple environments. This strategy works for both API checks and browser checks written in Playwright. First off, your Checkly account has global environment variables. You can manage them here in the web UI or list download and update environment variables in the Checkly CLI with npx Checkly env. Of course, remember that environment variables are not the right place to store secure credentials. A guide on authentication with Checkly and Playwright is linked below this video. Once you've set a global environment variable like base URL, you can write your checks to use the base URL variable like this. And now we can run our check and it'll pick up that environment variable. The next step depends on how often we want to check this second environment. If we're only going to run tests against our staging environment once in a while, we can run our tests as a one-off, say right before deployment. We can trigger checks with the Checkly CLI and feed in a different environment variable with the E flag. This technique is super helpful if we're integrating with our CI/CD process. For example, if we want to feed in a temporary preview URL at every run. But if we have two separate environments that we want to keep monitoring on a cadence, we probably also want to have separate settings for the environments with notifications going to different places and even different standards for what qualifies as failure. In that case, the best thing to do is have two groups of checks, one for each environment. You can duplicate a group in the web UI like this, or of course, if we're using monitoring as code, we can just copy the files and make a new group config file. With two separate groups, we can set custom thresholds, geographic scheduling, and alert channels. And we can set the environment variables that apply to all checks in that group. Group variables will override global variables of the same name. You can also set environment variables for a single browser check. Individual check variables will override both group and global variables. One nice thing once your checks are in a group, you can trigger them all together from the Checkly UI, just like this. With environment variables and multiple groups, you can make sure your checks and the alerts they generate are scoped to the right environment. For more instructions, check the links in the video description.